to the Wednesday, the hump day edition of Spotting. Tampa International. Yeah, oh, dark 30. 5 a.m. Oh, yeah, where's my coffee? Well, enough of me complaining. Let's get right into the aviation action. Thanks for being here. Hey, and our first contestant, 2962. TPA to MDW. Midway! Small little aircraft carrier runways. 737 MAX. Hey, where's the blue mood lighting on the inside? I don't see it. Oh, check this out. Going about as slow as you can go. This is a 60-year-old Aero Commander. Yeah, you heard me right. Six zero sixty. They should be collecting to Social Security, not flying. Say it better. Southwest right there, though. All right, let's get this show on the road. Oh, yeah, turn it and burn it. It's a way to start hump day. Another Southwest Boeing tail. 781 miles to Houston. That's it. Light it up. Light it up. This guy looks like he's going a little slower than the last Southwest. Let's turned it and burned it. Eh, bah humbug. No turn and burn here. Oh, I want a refund on this one. And 
and who is that over on the west side one left that's 1352 the cheesesteak special UPS from Philly I gotta make a couple, couple of stops in the elevator shafts. We've got a triple header, Spirit in the Sky, Norman Greenbaum, all load and freight here. Over at Airside A, Apple, Echo. Why would that be Echo? That makes no sense to me. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Yeah, notice only two cars on the tram. Not four like it was last weekend when I was much busier. Fourteen ten from FedEx. Seven six seven. There's another seven six from FedEx out there someplace as well. I think they're getting ready to turn downwind. No, I mean I think they're getting ready to turn the final. They're, yeah, they are on the downwind lake. Tail's not lit up. I want to refund it. Well, I thought we had another FedEx. No wonder why it confused me. That FedEx was actually overhead headed to Miami. This is even better. This is 1338 UPS. Oh, yeah. It's the MD-11, the tri-hauler. So I moved over to the, what am I in, the south, southwest corner of the long-term garage, capturing this beast. Thirteen thirty-eight on our right. Look at that uh, Delta jet coming behind it. How much brighter the lights are on the newer aircraft. Thirteen thirty seven Tampa runway one left, straight away in Windsor one three zero three, car straight turbulence, you're about seven and trail of the uh, heavy MD eleven. These, uh, these tri holders are old dogs. than typical aircraft. And that's all due to that small horizontal stabilizer they have in the back. Go around, go around, go around. They're just too high. So we're up to 
Second time's a charm for 1357. They were arriving about two minutes early. Now they're about two minutes late. Seventy-six to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Pitt. P.I.T. And the cabin looks all lit up still. Here we move down to the south end. Down to the economy lot. All right, let's put some big lights on. Come on, light it up. Light it up. Yeah. One hour, 56 minutes, 870 some miles.
Planes, trains, and automobiles. We got AA taxiing over on the west side. We got somebody else. Yep. Frontier. Oh, I can't tell who that is. Uh, I can't see in this little screen. Too fuzzy. We should have 1066 come popping out of there any second. Delta. Where are they? For Detroit. There they are. Spirit in the sky. Hey, that looks like Captain Neo, if you ask me. Contact departure. Have a good one. Good Parallel and uh, about four miles there. 800 feet, I guess, for me. And you can proceed on for the parallel. That's What's the new cargo me? area. They're doing a lot of nighttime uh, work here when it's cooler, it would be my assumption. Busy, busy, busy. Here they come. Rush hour. 1820 sitting down at one right. Spearing the sky to New Orleans. They've called the tower a couple of times. And what they don't realize is that there's, uh, there's already three or four aircraft ahead of them on the west side. So they're about fifth or sixth in line. <laughs> they're calling again. 1320, I hear you loud and clear, just have to find the parallel. <laughs> you should have said something sooner. We'll be at the parts of one right here just momentarily. I got the side working now, thank you. Okay. Now you can see News 9, top left, same up there. The copter. Stay east. I can twenty nine thirty contact the parts have a good one. <laughs> and for eighteen twenty down here. Still sitting. At least they're line up and wait now. This captain is not a fan now of the tower. They called tower multiple times and said they were down here. I take it the tower never heard them. If they would have said you're number four, five, or six, or whatever, for the pair. Or something to the effect that they're waiting for traffic on the other side.
16 to Rick Richmond VA. Las Vegas for 11:27. We got a helicopter working just, just east of these guys. Not even a half mile. Affirmative, 
The cigar special, Havana, Cuba. Thank goodness it was nothing major. Only cost them a couple of minutes of time. But safety first. Thirty-eight twenty-four. Heavy, <laughs> come out, come out, wherever you are. There they are. That's giant air running for prime air. Headed to Cincinnati's Northern Kentucky Airport. Twenty-year, twenty-eight-year-old, seven six seven. Thirty-eight twenty-four. Heavy thanks for your patience this morning. You can contact departure. Have a good one. Delta departure. Thirty-eight twenty-four. 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 This is 226 to JFK, the next contestant on one right. Boy, they're moving pretty good, huh? It's super thanks, super shout out time here at TPA. Super shout out to Tom Seagraves. Thank you, Tom. It's truly, truly appreciated. If you'd like to support the channel like Tom did, check out the Super Thanks icon. Back we go to the aviation action. That's 2018, so I will not continue. Yeah, that is 2018 right one left for land, land one one here for one minute for land here for
Riverside Special every time here at TPA. That's 1339 Southwest Tennessee 1 from Indianapolis. So many people ask me, why do they not do the entire airplane in those unique colors? Why do they leave the tail? I'm guessing it's marketing, but I really don't know. So I guess if you did uh, it all in red, you wouldn't know what airline it was. Well, bad timing on my part. They're closing one right. Here comes the crew. South 1339, when able to right, kind of ground point, so get it. Well, that worked out real well. Time to move. Well, gang, that's a wrap. That's going to conclude the Wednesday, the hump day edition of Spotting TPA at Tampa International. Hey, appreciate you being on board. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Glad to have you here. Hopefully, you'll take a moment, smash that subscribe button, like, share, and hit the notification bells we upload daily. Oh, yeah. You don't want to miss a single episode of all this fun. If you'd like to support the channel, please check out the Super Thanks icon. And as always, we'll see you again tomorrow on another edition of Spotty Champa International. See you!